What's going on YouTube? Welcome back to another reaction video. Today we have exciting videos to react to for any boxing fans out there. I'm a huge boxing fan. We're going back in time. We're reacting to the Battle of the Ages. Okay, a legendary fight between Evander Holyfield and George Foreman. We're reacting to the fight highlights. Hope you guys enjoy. Two of my favorite fighters. Literally two of my favorite fighters from uh, that era. George, I mean, the fact that he had a great career, retired for about 10 years, then comes back and becomes champion again, it's unbelievable. Vander Holyfield, the way he's built like that, and move around. Two heavy hitters, and Holyfield was, was a cruiserweight. He's a natural cruiserweight, and he goes up in weight and defeats Tyson, and defeats Holyfield. I'm sorry, Foreman. Those punches from George Foreman, man. Top five. Hardest puncher in history. 65 KOs out of 71 fights. That just proves it. He had such a, a chin, too. Like, look at that. Look at that. Any other person, maybe besides Muhammad Ali, is going down. I had this poster, the Ring Magazine poster that I'll be using in my thumbnail. I have that down in my basement. They gotta post more ESPN Classic Boxing and ESPN. They used to do it during quarantine, but I never ever see it. There's so many fights they could be posting. Oof. Fact that he's taking all those punches and he's staying up. Holyfield is obviously just a better fighter, just a better skilled fighter at this time. You know, take put Foreman obviously younger, obviously it'll be a different fight, but he wasn't a younger fighter here, so can't make excuses. There's a fact though that Foreman, almost 40 or maybe even 40 at this time, taking crazy punches. But he was giving it to Holyfield though. Wasn't no easy fight for Holyfield. George with a one two having a good rally here. Oh my gosh. And a little short chopping overcuts. The overhand right. Holyfield's got the fact that like Foreman took so many punches to the head and he talks fine. That's that's another crazy thing. I made a video on CTE the other day. About, you know, how people from Contact Sports is just act. Look at this, though. Like, all these blows to the head. And he just stays up. Round eight. Good jab there. You gotta, you gotta complete that punch for him. No reason to bring it back. You're already halfway through. Round nine. How do you think Foreman would do against Mike Tyson with a performance like tonight? Well, of course. That's just unbelievable. Oh, Definitely one of the best comebacks in sports, like as in a career. Um, is George Foreman. I know, of course, nobody talks about it because you know it's not football, basketball, or baseball. He's gonna go down though. Look at that, and he just stays up. That's what I'm saying about the chin. Muhammad Ali knocked him down, of course, but that's Muhammad Ali. But still. Yeah, no one's gonna no one's gonna consider Foreman's career. Come back uh, up there with all the other people because it's boxing and he's not as popular as Mike Tyson, Muhammad Ali, or other guys. His defense is so weird. He, you know what I mean? He's like like this. I never saw that style before. That punch, punch like that, any other, any other person going down. Holyfield just beating him like a heavy bag, but Foreman just being tough. 
prudent thing to do. And uh, below the border punches from Georgia. Foreman's obviously out of it. I mean, he's tired. I guess that's the consequences of being old and that big. What a great fight, though. Battle of the Ages, 100%. Two legends, two of my favorite fighters of all time. Yeah, Holyfield just landed way more punches. I'm looking for him and smiling. That's why I like him as well. Humble. I'm glad I reacted to this. I hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, I fell in love with boxing during quarantine. Um, football's my favorite sport, always will be, but boxing, um, that's a second now. It, it used to be basketball, baseball, track and field, so many other sports ahead of boxing. I, I didn't really care about boxing at all, really, um, until quarantine. I had nothing to do, just looked up boxing, boxing fights on YouTube, and guys like Foreman and Holyfield were some that would show up. You know, I'd see you know, Tyson versus Holyfield fights, or I'd see Rumble in the Jungle with Muhammad Ali and George Foreman. So, you know, this is why they're two of my favorites. Two of my favorite heavyweight fighters of all time. You know, I added Tyson Fury, and that's really basically my top three favorite heavyweights. Um, I enjoyed it, though. Two legends. Um, I'll try to react to more five highlights. You know, if you guys enjoy them, absolutely. But if this is like a dud video, not I don't get many views, well, I'll, I'll reconsider and just have to watch them again on my own time but hope you guys enjoyed if you guys did make sure to leave a like subscribe to my channel help me get the 7,000 subscribers it would be greatly appreciated i'm trying to get there i'm at a stalemate now so if you guys could subscribe that'd be greatly appreciated i'm out peace